In Oklahoma this morning with sunny skies and temperatures warming nicely. Let's take a look at some of the current lake levels as we move through spring. We start to feel these warm temperatures. Start thinking about the lakes with all the heavy rain over the last several weeks. We still have the lake levels well above average 27 feet above average right now at Keystone still running 25 feet above at Fort Gibson and 26 feet above at 10 killer. These levels have come down just a little bit, but you could tell you can tell still very, very high when we compare it to average. And it's going to take several weeks before these levels continue to drop off. But we're not tracking any rain out there this morning. Things are all quiet on Storm Shield radar. Not expecting anything around for today. We're just seeing beautiful weather area wide from Jinx East Intermediate out to the Tulsa International Airport up in Southeast Kansas and Independence. Also from downtown Tulsa, we're seeing blue skies looking really good this late morning. There's a live look from our River Spirit Cam as we're looking up Riverside heading towards 74. First Street, the Arkansas River fairly full at this time, and we're seeing temperatures running in the upper 70s, 78 currently with south southwest winds at 12 miles per hour. They'll stay out of the south and southwest at about 10 to 15, a few higher gusts throughout the day. So a little bit breezier today compared to what we saw over the weekend, but still not bad at all. 77 downtown, 77 in Jinx, also Sepulpa, Pru, you're setting at 77. Eastern sides of the metro, upper 70s to lower 80s, already up to 80 degrees in Broken Arrow. Claremore sitting at 81. Across the rest of eastern Oklahoma, temperatures upper 70s and low 80s as well. We're at 79 in Bartlesville, 77 Okmulgee and Henrietta over to Muskogee. Also 77 in Tahlequah, 77 this morning in Grove. And winds generally out of the south and south southwest at about 10 to 15 miles per hour. We're seeing winds anywhere from about 9 to 12 miles per hour right here in the metro. You notice out to the west a little bit stronger. Central and western sections of the state seeing those southerly winds about 15 to 20 miles per hour. These are sustained winds, some gusts over 20 miles per hour out to our west. But with the sunshine and those breezy south winds really helping to push those temperatures into the 70s this morning, 76 degrees in Kansas City. You notice we're 71 in St. Louis. So the center part of the country seeing nice mild temperatures. The east and the west dealing with cooler temperatures and thunderstorms in many locations to our west and east. But here in the center part of the country, looking good with the sunshine. And we expect more of that today on our future track as we move on through the afternoon hours. Mostly sunny skies. Temperatures will warm into the mid 80s in most areas. And we'll see south winds of 10 to 15 with some higher gusts. Then overnight tonight, mainly clear. We will see a little bit of high cloudiness starting to work into parts of central and southern Oklahoma. A few of those could drift into parts of eastern Oklahoma overnight. So we'll still say mostly clear. And temperatures will be on the pleasant side as we move on into our Tuesday morning. Here's looking at your afternoon highs, low to mid 80s, 86 expected in Tulsa, 85 in Pryor, 83 in Tahlequah, 85 as well in McAllister, also in Poto and Tallahena. Then for tonight, we'll see a light southerly wind and we'll see mainly clear skies. Again, a few high clouds around and temperatures in the upper 50s to lower 60s. So a nice mild start again, maybe a light jacket necessary for the kids at the bus stop tomorrow morning for an hour or two but they can get rid of that jacket quickly tomorrow as temperatures will warm. So a pleasant start, but a warm afternoon as we move on into our Tuesday with partly cloudy skies up to 85 degrees the afternoon high. We will see those temperatures uh, staying in the lower 80s as we move on into Wednesday. Good chance for showers and thunderstorms on Wednesday. And again on Thursday, we'll see a little bit of severe weather possible on Thursday. We're going to have to watch that closely on Thursday with highs generally in the mid to upper 70s. And then as we move toward the weekend, you notice Mother's Day on Sunday. We've got to have great weather, Daniel, for that. Absolutely. We're going to see mostly sunny skies and a high of 79 degrees, but you notice dotted in there for tomorrow when we have $2 Tuesdays looking good oh, out yes. of drillers. Thursday for the roughnecks, maybe a little bit dicey, but right now Mother's Day looking good. Well, good. That's all we need. You got good it. Good Mother's Day. Thank yes. you, Taft.